Okay, here we are again. Welcome back everybody. Back for another unboxing. Uh, as I mentioned before, we've been pretty lucky to get uh, a few pairs in this week. Just not a whole lot, but a few. Um, and uh, two of them were sent to us directly from Reebok. So we're thankful for that. And I thought we'd follow up the last video with this one and take a look at what Reebok has coming our way. I'm Patrick Dempsey on Instagram at Sneaker Grandpa and also online at sneakergrandpa.com. And as usual, I have my panel of experts with me. If you'll introduce yourselves, please, Vivi. Hello, I'm Vivian, and I'm eight years old, and I've been into sneakers for about five years. Excellent. Hello, I'm Georgia, and I'm five years old, and I've probably been into sneakers for three years. Okay, there you go. We're going to get into this pair. I think it's kind of obvious uh, looking at the box where it came from. Reebok. Reebok Classic. Reebok Classic. That's right. Let's get into it and see what we got. What's everybody thinking this one is? Maybe running. Maybe. I mean, uh, workout shoes. Workout shoes? Casual. Casual? Walking shoes. Walking shoes? Okay. The Dress shoes? shoes. You, ooh. The sh shoes that you wear a lot during the day. <laughs> okay. What do you got? Reebok Classic TDE Top Dwelling Top Dog Entertainment Top Dog Entertainment Kendrick Lamar Kendrick Lamar, that's right. Reebok! So we have, I think, uh, three pairs of Kendrick Lamar Reeboks now. And so this would be our fourth. It's actually the first time we've unboxed one of these, but let's see, let's get into it and see what we got. I like the box. Nice mm. little insert that came with it. That's what this is. Oh. And there we are. I like that it has the black and the white. The black and the white. This is actually the Reebok Club C. Um, and Kendrick Lamar's previous shoes had all had a red and a blue theme mostly. One shoe was red and one shoe was blue or had blue on it. And then another one that was green. But this one went in a little bit of a different direction. It's primarily red. It's got, uh, it's a sort of an acid wash denim almost like that with the black but except it's black instead of blue denim uh, with the white denim it's got um, here in the logo where it usually says Reebok it's got the black with the K the black with the dot so K dot for Kendrick Lamar we've got the red satin sort of feeling um, Ooh, tongue tag right there it feels like and that. then this actually reminded me of the Pharrell but the red line going across the back. It also comes with um, two sets of laces. It comes pre-laced with the black and then it's also got the white in here and then again on the inside it's got a black insole with the red uh, sort of slash line. It's a nice shoe. It's actually the the material is sort of soft. It's not real stiff. It feels pretty good. It seems like a again a durable shoe that could probably be worn with whatever, whenever. Don't have to worry about it being all suede and getting messed up. Uh, Georgia, what are your thoughts on these? What do you think? I like the denim and I like the K dots. I like the black and white string. What do you think I should go with? The black laces or the white laces? I like the white laces. Cause it doesn't have much white. So you think adding the white laces kind of brings out more of the white a little bit? I think yeah. black. You like the black better, Ruby? What do, what do you think about the shoe overall, Viv? They kind of look like a van style. Yeah? A little bit. Yeah, they do look like vans. It's actually a tennis shoe, like for playing tennis, the court, the Club C was. It's part of their court series. So it's got just a nice clean bottom there that says Reebok. Nothing special, but it's a very, very um, sticky almost outsole that's going to stick well and then just the bumps along the midsole here. It's um, not going to stay clean very long. On the it will bottom. stay clean but it's probably also pretty easy to clean with some type of cleaner. 
overall I like these a lot it's a very very nice shoe I like the material like I said is is lighter and feels like it may even be a little bit breathable I like the black contrast stitching that's on there is really cool I think the details that they did with the uh, the K dot on there were were pretty interesting it was kind of a cool take there's been a lot with Garb Store and others who have done taking the okay and things like that um, overall I think it's a pretty cool shoe I'm lucky and thankful to have these we're thankful to Reebok for sending them our way um, and I have to say that I'm not saying that I like them because they sent them to me because it's actually a shoe that I really really like I think a lot of people out there were a little, little bit hesitant and I don't think that there's any reason to be with these um, the price point is pretty reasonable for what they are and it is something that's different again it may not be for everybody but that's fine personally I get tired of everybody wearing all the same stuff and I think it's fun to wear what you like and not wear things just because everybody else has it. So I've seen enough Yeezys, I've seen enough NMDs, I've seen enough Ultra Boosts, and yeah, I've seen enough Jordans that every once in a while something a little bit different is okay to wear, even if it's not what everybody else is wearing. So I think Thank you for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. And Georgia? Comment down below if you like this video. Bye. Bye. Thanks. Bye.